Hey friends, I'm Joe Kurlowski, the super brave teacher, and today I don't feel so super or brave. Yep, I'm doubting myself a lot these days. Hey friends, it's really important for me to realize for myself that being super and brave does not mean putting on a super brave Joel Kurlowski persona all the time. Part of being super and brave for me means sitting with myself, sitting in the stillness and the silence and listening. And I've been doing that a lot lately, especially with the first week of school, I've just been trying to give myself some moments to sit and reflect. And I kind of know why I keep myself so busy. I keep myself busy because when I sit in this stillness and in this silence, all of a sudden the voices start coming. And the voices sound something like this. Joel, you said, you say every day that you want to put out a video and you want to get a million views. And look at your viewership. You don't even have 10,000 views. You're going nowhere. Joel, you are doing all these things and you say you want to be the most influential teacher in the world. But Joel, you, you, who knows who you are? Joel, you want to do all these things, but is anybody watching these videos? Why do you do all this hard work if no one's even doing it? If no one's even watching it? Joel, you're writing a book every day, but will anybody read your book? Will anybody even think that it's a good book? What if you start getting poor reviews? Are you ready for all that to ha start happening? And my brain just starts going and going and that is like a micro, micro, micro speck of what goes through my brain, especially these days when we have all these tools to check viewership and stats and how things are going. And once again, I just started this channel about two months ago. I just started writing my book a month ago and I am so proud of myself. That's not even a question. As I do this video right now, I'm like getting giddy just thinking about talking to all of you and putting this content out into the world. And we also live in a world that measures things with these metrics and says, this is success, this isn't success, this is good, this isn't good, this is failure, but you should fail forward and all these things. And that's why I just wanted to share this video saying, it's true, I do go through all this self-doubt, probably more these days than ever because I'm putting out into the world with all of you my true vulnerable self and it's scary, it's scary thinking that I'm gonna put out this video and check it in two hours and it's gonna say 12 views. Or I'm gonna check it and all of a sudden it has 200 views in five minutes and everyone putting comments on it and saying I relate to it and I'm like, wait, what, how? Uh, should I put out more self-doubt videos then? Should I do a super self-doubting teacher book? You know, and it's just all these things start going through your head. So thank you for listening to me just ramble this morning and just share with you that we're hard is hard and I'm sure you also are going through some self-doubt just like I am. And I could go to the cerebral side and say, you know what, Joel? You're done with the first week of school, so you're just tired, and this brings out more emotions in you, and, and I could just justify why I'm feeling why I'm feeling. I'm not even gonna do that. I'm just gonna sit in it more. I'm gonna head to the gym right now, and just get my sweat on right now, and just get my body moving. And I'm also not gonna go to the over-emotional side and just swim in this, oh, but I'm never gonna go anywhere. All I know is what I'm doing has never been done before by me. And I'm gonna keep putting out these videos. I'm gonna at least put out a hundred videos and see where that takes me. And I'm gonna at least finish my book and see where that takes me. Because you know what? That's something I can do every day. And there I go, <laughs> going to the cerebrality like, Joel, this is what you can do about your self-doubt. So I'm gonna stop even rambling because I'm just gonna be in it for a little bit. So. Thank you for being in it with me. Thank you for watching these videos. Like I always say, anytime you like or share these videos, you are, you are sharing an awesome message to YouTube that LGBTQ plus voices matter and that we need more positive visibility in the world. And this is just one, one, one way of doing that. So thank you so much. Like this video, share this video. You are appreciated, you are valuable. Even and especially if you have doubt, like me, have a great day, friends. Bye.